What if you could have a great looking app that handles everything you need? Think productivity tracking, client and task management, a clear financial tracker, your business plan, all in one beautiful interface. An app that supports handwriting on iPad, oh yes, has incredible zoom in and zoom out, works seamlessly on Mac, iPad and iPhone, and runs on a platform that is completely free. Yes, you heard me right free, with no subscriptions. With so many productivity and management apps on the market, it can be difficult to choose the right one. You either get lost with features you only use half of, or they just don't do enough. Not to mention the steep learning curve, the often uninspiring look, and usually your data gets stored on servers beyond your control. And the subscriptions? Yes, these days it seems almost every product or service comes with a monthly subscription. And before you know it, you're paying a small fortune every single month. So, what app am I talking about? Well, the good news is that you probably already have it. If you didn't guess it yet, I'm talking about Numbers, probably the most underrated Apple app. And I built this entire smart system powerhouse inside of it. By the way, you can download this exact template, link in the description. Now, I know, when you think of Numbers, you probably picture boring Excel-style spreadsheets. But as you can see, the result honestly feels much closer to a premium, full-fledged second-brain CRM app. Of course, it took me some time to create. It's packed with hidden formulas and smart logic working behind the scenes. The kind of thing that could take you days, if not weeks, to figure out from scratch. But using it, it's just plug and play. And honestly, I'm really proud of the result. So let me show you how and why I built it, and more importantly, everything it can do. And spoiler alert, it can do amazing things most paid apps can do. Now, just for context, a few months ago, before launching this YouTube channel, I was running a demanding seven-figure real estate operation. First as a CEO, and later as a team leader of a multi-million dollar company. For nearly a decade, my life revolved around scaling business, designing operational systems, closing high-stakes deals, and leading teams under pressure. This is to say that this template reflects insights gained from all those years, building high-performance systems, coaching hundreds of professionals, and bringing clarity to chaos. And the reason I built it in numbers instead of using one of those feature-packed subscription apps is because I firmly believe that for most of us, freelancers, creators, solopreneurs, entrepreneurs, simpler systems win. Overly complex tools often lead to overwhelm. We end up spending more time managing the tool than actually doing the work. And so this system was designed around that philosophy. Clean, intuitive, and focused on the essentials you actually need day to day. Enough of talk, let me walk you through each part of the system, because this isn't just about features, it's about giving you exactly what you need to stay focused, in control, and on track. Ok, this is the control center, the page you'll probably open every single day. It gives you exactly what matters most. No fluff, no distractions. Your key metrics are front and center. Lead counts, revenue, pipeline value, overdue tasks, high priority items, and the best part, all calculated automatically, thanks to the smart formulas running behind the scenes. Right here, space for your big why, your motivation, the reason you wake up every single day to do what you do, and a spot for your key weekly focus areas. And in terms of the aesthetics, I went for a minimalist and modern design, but you can make it your own style. You can change the background color, images, lettering style and colors, uh, the type of tables, then the test board is where you organize your entire week, see what's overdue, high priority, do today or this week, all with clear icons and visual cues thanks to conditional formatting. Need to filter just for this week's high priority tasks? Done. It's dynamic and keeps you on point. And remember, this sync perfectly across your Mac, iPad and iPhone via iCloud. Then there's the client flow section. This is your CRM, simplified and actually useful. Track lead status, interest level, source, notes, and deal value. The smart filters let you instantly search or filter. And here's that magic again. You can just pick your Apple Pencil and write whatever you want here. Like right inside the template. Try doing that on most web apps. I don't know of any that allows you to do that, but if you know about one, just let me know in the comments. And this is one of the most important parts to me. I cannot tell you how many times the only thing I really want is to circle something or write some quick note to point something important. And with the Apple Pencil, this is so easy and fast, it's really a game changer for me. Ok, moving on to the money tracker section, financial clarity starts here. You can set your annual revenue goal and the system automatically breaks it down into monthly and weekly targets visible across the dashboard. Log your revenue and expenses and instantly see color-coded signals. On track, profitable, 
close to target, you even get charts showing revenue sources and expense distribution, and your progress to reach your financial goal. So it gives you powerful financial control built right in. If you're working with a team like I used to, this is incredibly helpful, because back in the day, I would plug my iPad to this big screen and start writing notes of all the important things we were discussing, and everyone will see it in real time on the big screen. So it's really, really useful stuff. Okay, moving on to the resources page. Now, this one is deceptible, it's simple, but powerful. Tired of notes scattered everywhere? Here you can drag and drop almost anything. Screenshots, documents, links, even notes from the Notes app. I mean, how cool is that? It's a flexible visual repository for all your project-related resources, keeping everything tidy within the Apple ecosystem. And last but not least, the GPS page. Goals, priorities, strategies. This is where long-term vision meets daily action. You can define your yearly goals and divide it into three priorities with all the strategies you need. It's based on high-performance frameworks I use to coaching teams for years. And I've been using the GPS system for the last decade. Heck, I'm still using it today because it really provides the structure needed to ensure you're working on what truly matters. I mean, and this is just a tip of the iceberg of what you can do with numbers. It's so much more than a spreadsheet app, especially when combined with the Apple Pencil. So what are the big pros of using a system like this inside Apple's numbers? Well, first of all, it's free and works natively on every Apple device you own. It has seamless iCloud sync across Mac, iPad and iPhone, which keeps everything up to date. It has unique handwriting support with Apple Pencil on iPad. You have full offline access, which means your work isn't dependent on an internet connection. You own your data because it's stored locally or in your iCloud, not on some unknown third-party server. It's highly customizable, both visually and functionally, and it has a powerful formula engine. All right, but let's be honest, uh, number isn't perfect. No app is. Where does it fall short compared to dedicated, expensive platforms? The first thing is there is no automations. You're not getting complex Zapier-like automations. My take, most people get lost in those anyway, or don't even use it. So this system encourages intentional action. You update the status, you move the client, reinforcing clarity. But if you do need it, numbers is not for you. It doesn't have notification, so no push alerts for every due date, uh, but the dashboard uses these clear visual cues, colors, icons, to highlight what's overdue or urgent. And if, like me, you're using this daily as your command center, you will see what needs attention. And finally, there's no calendar integration. It doesn't automatically push tasks into your Apple or Google calendar. But to be completely honest, most people that I know prefer keeping task management separate from calendar scheduling. So you can use your favorite calendar app for blocking time and use this system for managing the work itself. And that said, I'm from a time where CRMs were really crappy, like really, really crappy. And everyone used ugly Excel spreadsheets, myself included. And still, things got done. Today, it's even easier just using a focused stack like numbers, your calendar app, and maybe reminders and notes. Everything is free, works seamlessly together and runs across all your Apple devices. So there you have it. Apple numbers far more capable than you probably thought, right? It allows you to create a truly powerful, visually appealing, integrated system for managing your work, especially if you're embedded in the Apple ecosystem and love using your iPad. You get control, clarity, and I think the most important thing, handwriting integration. All of this without adding another monthly subscription. Uh, it's kind of a no-brainer. Now, at the end of the day, it's all about choosing the app that makes you work faster and gives you control and clarity over your business. There will always be compromises. I personally like something simple that gives me everything I actually need and looks good because I use it for long periods of time every single day. So it better looks good. And of course, the cheaper, the better, which in this case is completely free. So let me know what you think. Are you surprised by what numbers can do? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.